one summer evening, Edwin and I were sitting talking about the terrible unemployment in Oswestry and the area. And Edwin said to me, why don't you start something up with some of these people in their leisure time, play reading, that sort of thing. And I said, well, I think I'd be much more interested in taking the people of our valley, where I think there's a lot of talent, mm. and um, doing under Milkwood, which was always an ambitious ambition of mine to do under Milkwood in Technicolor with Welsh people. And so we said, well, I wonder if there's an interest in starting a dramatic society in the area, because the only one that there was was a Welsh speaking one. There was nothing for people who didn't speak Welsh, and that covered all aspects of, the, you know, of, of entertainment, musical things and, and drama and so on. So we put um, a piece in our local paper. So you see, it's a very active valley, mm. and we put a piece in the um, Tanner Chronicle, uh, inviting people along one evening to meet, and 40 people turned up. A so. lot of people. I mean, a surprising number, really, isn't it? Mm. Mm. For people who presumably had never acted before. I should say, in our first show, 95% of them had not even been on stage. I've never actually seen anybody eat um, that is newspaper, isn't it? Good luck with the diet. <laughs> Do you take me to tabloids? With your brain and your heart of ice, do you feel cold? <coughs>
Would you look at the letter, please, darling? You got that? Yes, sir. This delicious meal, my friends, is my courtesy and message to Boggish Boat Symphony. You see, I told you so. Also, said the president. 